Pisces, welcome back to my channel. I'm so happy to have you guys here. So today we're going to be doing a reading for Pisces, Pisces Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, and North Node. In case you don't, you do not know your astrological placement, please check out the description box below where I have uh, mentioned all the details on how you can check your birth chart for free. All right, my loves. Also, if you find this reading resonates with you, then you can subscribe to my channel, comment, like, share. All right, that helps the algorithm of my channel move around so that these videos can also circulate and help people that need the help. All right, so let's see, my loves, let's see what's coming up for Pisces Pisces, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, and North Node. Pisces, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, and North Node. What's coming up for the month? okay pisces i can see that in the past um you have been extremely burdened now these burdens could be coming from people who are around you this could be in terms of your family in terms of your relationships in terms of um, the financial decisions that you have had to make in the past due to being responsible for a lot of people it could be in your family or in your business right but it's like you have taken on too much onto yourself, you know. Uh, there's just a lot of pressure that's on to you right now. And that is causing for you to kind of almost give up in a sense. Almost feel like, you know, um, was anything that I did in the past for people who I love, was it even worth it? Because at the end of the day, it's creating problems in my health. It's creating problem in my physicality or in my uh, health in you know uh, numerous ways so there has been a lot of challenges that you have had to deal with in the past uh, and that is causing you a little bit of stress a little bit of frustration uh, to the point where you want to like get over it now get rid of a particular person a particular relationship a particular job um, where you know you have not received the amount of respect that you should have received you know when you are in that situation when you're working hard for an organization and you know the boss is not appreciating you for your work or um, you're putting in a lot of work in the relationship but you are not getting anything in return and you're taking care of the kids you're taking care of the house and you don't get a certain appreciation for that or um you could be the person who's always punctual on time and you know finishing your tasks on time and things like that and yet you're not getting appreciated for that level of hard work and that level of perseverance um in whatever it is that you do right so i can see that in the past there has been some difficulty in uh, getting to a stable place within yourself and uh, there's been a lot of challenges and obstacles on the way for you here okay so i'm seeing that you kind of get rid of these uh responsibilities these burdens that you have shouldered by yourself all alone you know um i can see that at times you have a habit pisces of taking on too much than is necessary you know and you feel that you know everybody uh needs to be taken care of by you and it's your responsibility to keep a smile on other people's faces uh but that's not true okay that's not true um everybody is responsible for their own happiness for their own sense of well-being and when you spread yourself too thin for other people and you don't have anything to give to yourself that's when you feel depleted so you're finally realizing that you have to leave these toxic ways of uh taking on everyone's burdens on your shoulders and you know be the martyr and you know uh sacrifice yourself for others and you're finally coming to the realization that uh, that is not going to help you on the long run you know so you're trying to develop better habits that are going to help you in the long run that are going to make you feel more desirable more fired up about your life more fired up about your goals you know and about your visions of the future right so definitely i'm seeing that uh, that is going on for you since the past year um now let's see what what is the energy in the present because um i'm glad that you're realizing that you know this was too much for you to carry all by yourself right so now we have um temperance in reverse in the present okay 
सो पाइसी इज वट इज़ हैपनिंग राइट नाउ इज़ ड्यू टू यू रिलीजिंग द बर्डन ऑफ द पास्ट समवेयर इट्स मेकिंग यू स्लाइटली इम्पेशेंट स्लाइटली इम्पेशेंट टूवर्ड्स मेकिंग दोज चेंजेस यू नो मे बी इन द पास्ट यू टुक अ लॉन्ग टाइम टू यू नो काइंड ऑफ अंडरस्टैंड दी अदर पर्सन सी वेर दी अदर पर्सन इज कमिंग फ्राम हैव दी एम्पथी टू गिव दैम द टाइम एंड द स्पेस टू अंडरस्टैंड दैट एट टाइम्स दे ऑल्सो मेक फॉल्ट एंड दैट दे आर नॉट परफेक्ट इन एवरी वे एज दे से दे आर राइट सो यू कुड हैव बिन डीलिंग विद अ परफेक्शनिस्ट और समबडी हु ऑलवेज बिलीव्स इन हैविंग द परफेक्ट डेट हैविंग द परफेक्ट नाइट विथ यू और doing things in a way where it pleases you and uh pleases you to an extreme level or something like that so i'm seeing that there are certain bad habits that you picked up from a relationship and uh there are some habits that you absorbed onto yourself and one of them is the impatience the impatience to move forward the impatience to uh kind of not be able to give yourself some time and some rest and some alone time to cleanse and purge uh the necessary burdens that you had picked up from other people right uh because this process takes time if you're letting go of certain responsibilities it takes some time you know but uh you're kind of getting a little impatient with that process so i would definitely recommend you uh doing something that is productive for you in a day like for example um you could do things like uh, okay so there's this new app that i downloaded it's called fabulous and in that app it's like an app that uh is based on behavior behavioral science where it kind of changes your behavior changes your habits uh and it gives you small tasks to start with first it gives you a questionnaire on certain uh questions about your life and about your patterns and how you feel about a certain thing or how uh, your routines are about sleeping and things like that like uh, some questions that you have to ponder about and after that it will give you an analysis of um small habits that you can start developing so that you can completely transform your mindset you know because here i definitely see a mindset issue that is coming up for you where um because of so so much that you took on in the past you're not giving yourself the time to heal you're not giving your yourself the time to rest but you're going and going and um this could cause some health issues or, or it could make things worse than they possibly are right now okay so i am being told to guide you to download this app number 1 i'm not sponsored by the way so don't worry about that um download this app and try it out at least it will give you a foundation to start working on you know so that you don't have to um blame yourself for stuff of the past and kind of take it into another relationship and then you know kind of destroy that relationship in the process of you uh getting out of the past and not healing from it appropriately right So yeah this is all about purging for you and that is how you'll be able to finish this cycle that is how you'll be able to master this cycle and uh, learn the lessons that you were supposed to learn from this particular cycle where you were taking on too much onto yourself okay so let's see so once you do this once um, okay let's see wow so we have eight of pentacles here at at the future uh, energy for you for your spread right so once you start making these changes like i said i can definitely see that you will uh, develop some very very healthy habits it could be um, you making small changes over time where you're working very hard on mastering a certain uh, project a certain skill a certain talent uh, or taking your time with your partner before building a relationship knowing that you need to build yourself back up because in the past you could have lost yourself in the other person to the point where you lost your own balance uh, you lost your own center and now to come back to your center it's like you have to com- uh, you have to start focusing on your life on your goals instead of uh, being there for the other people and uh, draining yourself of your life force of your energy uh, now you're putting all that energy back into yourself into your craft into your uh, skills that you want to develop into the kind of course that you want to do or uh, what university you want to go to or what 
online course you want to get into like i said right so you'll be perfecting your financial attributes you will um definitely start understanding yourself in a better way to the point where you can have a healthy connection and a healthy relationship with someone where you both can work things out for each other but you also share that space where um you are independently working on yourselves rather than depending on each other for finances or for uh, income or because those things create codependency right where if you are reliant on one person um for your income or for um your survival in life uh it can create a lot of challenges for you when you have to separate or when you have to um kind of take your space you know for yourself so yeah this is definitely what i'm seeing for you there are a lot of improvements a lot of uh strength that is developing within you through these improvements and this is going to create major changes for you in the future all right my loves so i'm keeping it short and sweet uh i didn't I didn't uh read your cards like I did the other other zodiac signs in this particular series but um I think that I covered a lot of areas in this uh so let me know how you felt about the reading also you could be dealing with uh, Sagittarius strongly or you could have Sagittarius in your chart or you could be dealing with a Virgo or a Capricorn as well or you could have these in your chart okay um let me see is there anything else i'm missing i think that's about it so just make sure that you're taking care of your health you're taking care of your exercise because uh maybe you have become a little overweight and you're now trying to lose weight or you have lost a lot of weight at a very quick pace because you were getting very impatient um and that is not going to produce long lasting results so if you're doing something quickly out of impatience that is not going to pay off in the long run so make sure that you are paying attention to uh pacing yourself you know which is why i told you to download that app okay so let me know how that app works out for you and as well as let me know if this resonated with you my loves okay i'm keeping it short and sweet thank you so much my loves for watching this video i hope you enjoyed this and peace